Hello everyone, my name is Carter and welcome back to another video of Carter FNAF Adventures. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice got cracked right there. But yeah. So uh, today we're gonna review uh, the new two the new uh, Walmart exclusives of Shamrock Freddy, Rival Toy Freddy, and the mystery mini of Toxic Spring Trap. I finally got him, so yeah. So so let's get started with reviewing Shamrock Freddy. After all, uh, Shamrock Freddy is my favorite skin after all, because he has my favorite color, green. That's why I really love Freddy, because Freddy's my favorite character, but I really like his skins. This one's my favorite skin. And also, I will compare them to the other exclusives from last year. Uh, I, did, I forgot to bring uh, Chocolate Freddy, because I'm on vacation, as you can see. Uh, yeah. But yeah, uh... But yeah, I really like this Shamrock Freddy plushie, and I also really like how they did with the ears, to be accurate. To be accurate with the uh, FNAF uh, models, or Freddy models, I have no idea. But I really like his, uh, I really like his green eyeballs, uh, and also I will compare him to his, his action figure counterpart at the end of the video, so stay tuned. But yeah. But for some reason, I'm deep pointing on the, uh, the chain, and also his body is also a different color. Like, I just noticed that, look. As you can see very closely, the colors of his green skin is quite different because they kind of printed his uh, necklace. And you can basically see that. This is why I don't like printing because it, mis it mismatched the colors. Because for Shamrock Freddy, for a good example, his colors of his shade of green is not matching his actual green color. But it's understandable because, you know, it needs to be with the printing on the uh, chain. And also, uh, they also give him the same bow tie, just like Chocolate Freddy and Chocolate Bonnie. And a few others, I don't remember. But yeah, that's sh that was Shamrock Freddy. And also, uh, I'll give him a, hmm, a 10 out of 10 just because he looks so accurate. So, here's his picture right now. Okay, let's go ahead and move on to the next plushie, which is Live Wire Toy Freddy. <laughs> what? I have to make something funny here. Anyways, <clears throat> uh, here is Live Wire Toy Freddy. Uh, I really, like, I really like his plushie. Uh, I'm pretty sure he's inaccurate because I'm pretty sure in the picture, as I remember, uh, I haven't played for Navajo that much, so forgive me. He's more like a brown and yellow color. This one, how particular, is just a red, brown, and yellow. Oh, he's higher than one member it. And his wires coming out of his eyes are supposed to be green. So I'll put up a picture right now. Oh. Alright. But yeah, uh, it still looks cool. It has a... And also, they just printed on the bow tie and the buttons. What's up with your printing, Mongo? But th there were some things I liked about printing. Just for the obvious things. But, uh, yeah, but, uh, you know, the, you know me. I'm just not a big fan of printing. I just like the original style that Funko used to, to do with uh, Wave 1. But, yeah. But I really like these plushies. These plushies are really amazing. And well talented. I think I just like Shamrock Freddy the most. Just Life Wire Freddy just needs to be more accurate to his actual game counterpart. Moving on, and actually, last but not least, is Toxic Screen Trap. Yeah, this is now like a very long review for you, isn't it? But yeah, here is Toxic Screen Trap. Uh, so, um, uh, so I really like how this one turned out. I think. This one's way better than the action figure. I know I said in the last videos, like in the last few videos, I like the action figure more, but now I'm just questioning, my, questioning myself. I think I kind of like this one because it actually m looks more accurate to this actual game counterpart. If you could, if you look very closely in his mouth, you can basically see William Matthews' uh, skull in there, like how he is in the game. You know, like, in, in his jump scare, he opens his mouth, and, and the Willie Mountain's mouth, like, follows it or something. I don't remember. But, uh, yeah. 
But uh, yeah, I think I really like this video. Uh, yeah. I really like this mystery mini. It looks really amazing. I really like the details, so yeah. I'll give it a 10 out of 10. And uh, I totally forgot to give a live wire toy video for waiting. But yeah, I'll give this one a. Uh, uh, oh, I know. A, a 9 out of 10. Just because they tried. But yeah, that is all for today's review for you guys. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Make sure you like and subscribe, okay? Okay, see ya.